Hello guys, so I'm here to do kind of a tasting video. I know I did the crepe gummy like this on Studio L'Oreal, but I just decided that these were almost just too simple, too minor to put on Studio. So I'm going to do them over here, kind of as a demo slash tasting. I think this one is really, really simple. So this is Mogi 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 Fruits Gummy. So it's like Mogi Mogi is like mogu is so like pick so pick pick fruit gummies <laughs> and it says um pick them from the grape tree i don't know why it says tree because I don't grapes grow on vines but anyways grape flavor muscat flavor is like a green grape and melon soda flavor okay so characters on here are very cute and there are no real directions on here, obviously, but it says chewing strength is something a child needs, so I guess gummies are good for children. Okay, so I opened it up, and I'm assuming that the vine is the melon soda flavored, but um, this one is very, very simple. And let's see, there are 74 kilocalories in this package, so obviously it's a great vine, and I guess we'll open it up and taste it, if I can. Okay well so I guess you just pick them off let's try this do I have to peel it off does it just come off okay <laughs> um, right so I just kind of ripped it off so I'm assuming this is a grape one and I'll give it a taste mmm it is a grape gummy it is a little bit sweeter than the hundred percent juice gummies that I have eaten and that I like but um it's still good it's very chewy it's almost a hard kind of gummy but I mean it tastes fine tastes good and I guess I'll try the muscat one next <laughs> my hands are all sticky yeah I'll show it to you up close yeah it looks pretty detailed <laughs> tastes like muscat tastes fine um I don't know what am I supposed to say it tastes good <laughs> And what I'm curious about actually is the melon soda part, and I'm assuming this is the melon soda part. Now, I don't like real melon soda, so I don't know if I'm going to like this. But when I opened the package, it smelled really strongly of grapes, so let's see. This smells like melon. I'm going to taste it. It tastes like melon, but it could also pass as green apple. Like if it said on the package, green apple, I would say, oh, it's green apple. So, it's obviously artificial flavoring. But yeah, so this was Mogi Mogi Fruit. Obviously, very simple. But um, I think the sushi one's gonna be more interesting. I think you get to put them together. It says Shari ni neta wo nosero. And neta is like the fish part, and Shari is the bottom rice part. So there are three flavors Sumomo, I think that's plum, I'm not sure. And then lemon and banana. I wonder how you tell lemon and banana apart. And then it tells all the types of fish Ikura, Tako, Tamago, Ika, Maguro, uh, Akagai and ebi, um, shrimp, squid, octopus, ikura is like the fish eggs, um, salmon, ro I don't know what you call them, egg, maguro, tuna, and akagai is a type of shellfish, I think? So, oh, and it says the flavor changes when you put them together, banana and sumomo, banana and plum are apricot, and banana and lemon are soda, so we'll see. And it says, find the octopus! Um, I think it's that guy. Okay, and this has 72 kilocalories, so I guess it's a little bit less than the grapes. <laughs> okay, let's open it up. Ta-da! So, this actually looks familiar. Have we done this before? No, I'm not sure. But, um, here are the little rices. And I guess, let's see. These are the banana flavored? Yeah, the rice is banana flavored. These are lemon flavored, and these are the plum flavored. So, no more like sour peaches I'm not sure okay so this is all gonna come out nicely Ta -da! so I guess I'll put them all together first we'll let the egg I think I don't know what's what but I'll put it on here it's a very fat sushi and then I guess we'll do a shrimp ebi then we'll do the akagai what type of shell that is. Ah, they're stuck to each other. Ooh, and look, there's like a little film. I think the jelly leaked out of the mold. Okay, so let's see if it actually is soda. Oh no, they're stuck together. Okay. 
lemon, and banana. To be absolutely honest, it tastes like banana and lemon. But I kind of got a little, a little taste of soda in there. But the gummies are so hard that it's kind of hard to keep them together and chew them together and get the flavor together, if that makes sense. So, yeah. So I'm going to try the um, other one see if it tastes like apricot. I don't know if I even know what apricots taste like. I wonder what the lemon and plum taste like together. I do not know what that tasted like. This tastes like peach, so some of them, maybe it's a type of peach or plum. I'll have to look that up, but I think it's like a plum. Um, and it was a little tart. And then the banana, obviously. I could not find the apricot in there, but maybe. So, um, I don't know if putting the flavors together actually tastes like the flavor they say they taste like. But the gummies themselves don't taste bad at all. They have nice flavor, pretty sweet, and very chewy and harder gummies. But... Yeah, I, I, you're right. I don't know if I would call this a DIY candy, but I think it would be fun for littler kids, younger kids, or just people that like gummies to eat. So if you have a chance to try these, I would say go for it. Um, I would not say they are my favorite gummies of all the gummies I've ever eaten, but they don't taste bad if that is that means anything <laughs> so um i think that is it for now and i will see you guys next time thank you for watching and let me know if you'd like me to try something new to taste or i don't know but i'm willing to try anything so let me know bye